six and I will soon be seven. And I don't be to bed no more. I'm seven. No, I'm six and I saw it seven. You know, baby people bed. Big kids be, no, big kids do people bed. Nickel baby always people that cut it is baby and big kids is no people bed. Cause they be big kids. Big kids no people bed. But small kids then people bed and love people bed. And do the video. And I see big kids then no people bed are no do not bed. We give you the facts, it's not what you think. Popeye News Link, Young King, One Yard, bless. Good morning, Popeye. Grandma watch Popeye's every morning and every night. Greetings, greetings viewers and subscribers. In this video, we are going to be chatting to a father. Whilst many men are playing the role of only a sperm donor, this father, he's saying that all he wants to do is to know for sure whether or not he is this young girl's father and he wants to play a role in her life. Mark you, as the saying goes, there are three sides to a story. Mr. Williams, he'll be telling his side of the story in this video. It's a long conversation and it might even get boring at times, but I implore you to listen to what he has to say and drop your comments in the comment section below. Also, share the video also hit on the thumbs up button and mother yes you mother i know you're gonna be hearing this interview if you do not agree with what mr williams is saying and you want to share your side of the story all you have to do is send me a whatsapp message to 876 343 1034 that's 876 343 103 three four here is what mr williams has to say listen this is a situation where me me have this little girl mm -hmm. and the mother will go on for a while you know yeah who yeah who me and the mother yes yeah but you know after you would ban we start a separate we start a break up yes we still, have, we still have, a, have a a good parental relationship yes most time the child is with me when the child starts school and me go find a school. Come live away from one and burn to one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is my solution. But through the mother live a mobile you now. You know, so as a as a girl, the the child will do with the mother. Mm -hmm. So when you're ready to go to school, miss we find a school at Water Lane. Uh, that's a challenge basic school at Water Lane, they have Church Street. Yes. Yeah. So we start juggling the youth. How old is you? How old is you? No. 2011, you know, so. Oh, 2011, okay, all right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, so anyway, the mother, the mother come said to me one time, said that she get a break to go a friend, so she have go. I thought in 2016. Yes. You understand me? Mm -hmm. So, she want me rally around the youth because I just me and she, the child, used to all do it. She used to stay with the, with her father up at Spot Valley. The mother live at Spot Valley with her father. Yes. The mother, father. you understand me? Mm-hmm. So she said, make sure I say, me in control of the youth. The day when she supposed to go away, she never contact me. Because me there burnt one and she never said nothing to me, say, today she go. So I just a mind come to me and say, you know, I go for your youth. Anyway, me reach a school for the youth. School over two o'clock. Yes. Me never, me never reach a mobile until minutes to five. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so when we reach a school in the evening, the teacher said, Mr. Williams, I've been, I've been wondering what happened to her. To the mother, whatever, and then she recall and said that. But not today, the mother said that she going far and nobody come for the youth. Anyway, I call it the youth and take her to the home up of Spot Valley. Yes. I get the telephone from go school the morning. Mm -hmm. You understand me? And when we reach up here, it was after six. The, the, she, she have a sister that was there. That is the mother of a sister that was there. A bigger sister than the mother. Mm -hmm. When me I call him, the sister, she not answer. So the little girl said to me, Daddy, let's go around the back and, and, and call. So when she went around there, she said, the, the sister. So the sister refused to accept the child. 
Yes. So for what, whatever reason, I don't know. Anyway, I just take the child at the same time and just head home to my house. That that was 2016, so the child would have... That was, uh-huh. Yeah, that was, that was 2016. Any, any question you want to ask? Because you don't know, say... Yeah, man, yeah, man. I know, I know. So the child would have been, the child would have been five at that time? Right. All right, go on now. Mm-hmm. Right. So I take, take the child and, and, and bring her home to my house. Mm-hmm. You know? In Westmoreland? Yeah, man. Mm-hmm. And then... About a week and a half, and then we find a school right a farm pen there. That's another issue too. We find a school right a farm pen. We start sending her about the school. We text the mother and tell her that we find a school, and we not sending back the child to Montego Bay because situations. And she was really mad about how our sisters deal with the situation. Anyway, child of the school. Mm-hmm. The mother didn't come back until that about October, November now. No? Yes. When this, yeah. The mother didn't came back until February 24th. There was a female road party show at 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 broadcast at, at South in South. Mm-hmm. This is February 24th. Which year? Which year? That is 2017. Oh, man. Uh, oh next year. The next year. Uh-huh. Right. The following year. Mm-hmm. There was a female road broad- outside broadcast, and I went there with the child after school. And when we reached back home, it was some minutes after. After eight in the evening, because I stopped by Miss Miller, who is our family friend that is there and Miller, them. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. So when I reached home the night, I the mother, I was here and the grandmother on my veranda. Yes. You know? Mm-hmm. In a way, we take the child went in and we take off our clothes and grocery and all of that. And, you know? The mother had a man, had a man that she wanted to take the child up to Spot Valley. I said, No, you cannot take the child out of the house. At this time of the night, you don't have a personal drive. And it's now after 9 o'clock. So did you, did you know that the mother was in Jamaica? No. All right, when, when the mother was away during that time, she tried to contact you and talk to the child? One time. Okay. No, not the child. She just contact me. She don't talk to the child. Okay. Right. Anyway, I was at a man that you cannot leave to take the child. Mm-hmm. And I stand my ground. Because you cannot take the child. leave school leave for school from 8 o'clock in the morning. Mm-hmm. And it's now after 9 o'clock. And you want to take the child out to Spot Valley on a public tran- on public transport, four different public transport. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you have no concern for the child, so you cannot. Do it. it was gonna be it was gonna be the the Ash Wednesday, and I said to her, "Why don't you just wait until Tuesday? You come for the child, keep her for the whole the whole um Ash Wednesday weekend, and that would be okay because that the twenty fourth was a Friday evening." All right? Yes. The 24th of the Friday, right? So I said, just wait until Tuesday evening you come for the child and you can have her. She yeah. said, okay. I went to Negril the, 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 the following Monday, which was a holiday, which was a work day. Mm-hmm. When I, when I went to pick up the child at 2.30, there was the mother and the, and the grandmother, same week, apparently she didn't wait, went up, she stayed by the mother, by her mother, who lives in Farm Pen. Mm-hmm. And, she, and she claimed that she would take up the child. I don't say anything. I said, okay, go ahead. Go to the one. Anyway, we run, we run this situation the same way. The child stayed with me during school week, school days, and she collected the child Friday evening and bring her back from Monday morning school. When the, when the, when the, the graduation for the child, because you know, she will finish kindergarten you now. Yes. So the graduation would be the June. She was supposed to collect the child for for preparation for, for graduation, she didn't. Anyway, when I see my brother, I'm specific until. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. After the summer holiday, when the, during the summer holiday after the, after the child graduation, from kindergarten, she called me during the ending of the summer holiday that she going back to fine. Yes. And I said, how can I be doing this to the child? The child is now six years old and she needs her mother's attention because of things that she's saying to me. She need mother's attention. She said she she do her thing already and she have to go and whatever. I said, just give me four months. Just spend four months with the child. Because I was planning to go on the island. On an island. I said, just give spend four months child. Get associated with the child because the child keeps telling me also that you don't love her. You know? Yes. You love food and all of them things and you don't spend no quality time with her. So she's she's not into what is happening. So please just spend some time with the child. Let the child know that you have a mother. She wouldn't have any of that. Yes. I said to her, I said to her find a school in Montego Bay 
and let me do, and I'll do the honors. Just contact me. And Virgin Papa, you know, so she don't contact me again. No mm-hmm. call me try to call her. She don't call she don't call me back. So where was it where was the child that time? With her in Montego Bay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Right? All all in this all during when the school start when the school back to school start, the new school year start, which is September, I try calling her, she refused my call. If I do get her, she hand the child the phone to the to the to the child. Child kept asking me, Daddy, when I'm going back to school, okay, I decided that I'm going to find a school and, and get the child in. But one day I was I was standing out by Godfrey Stewart Crossroad here, right at the cross intersection at Godfrey Stewart, mm-hmm. with a friend talking about five o'clock, and I heard a taxi coming. There was a taxi coming from Cummings End, coming mm-hmm. into stop. Mm-hmm. I heard a child saying, "Daddy, Daddy." I didn't know it was her, you know, because the car was driving slowly. But she, the child knew the corner, got the rasta. We cook out at the corner and bridge, and we always go. They go eat, and she love rasta food. Yes. You know, so they know, she knew she knows. Say that is a spot that I'm always at. So she was looking out. So I heard the child saying, "Daddy, daddy, daddy." And when the car reached up to the to the to the stop sign, now the car has to stop to for the stop sign. I realized that it was the child, my child, my daughter. Yes. You understand me? So, but I didn't see whose lap the child was in. Because the child was sitting into a lady's lap and I didn't see. So, I figured it was the grandmother. Yes. You know, so I, 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 I involved my friend now in the conversation. And I said, it looked like that's my daughter. So I said, there goes my daughter because the car is continuing driving now. So, there goes my daughter. Mm-hmm. And, I said, and I said to myself that if the mother wanted to go away and leave the child with her grandmother, I said, no, oh, just call me and tell me to monitor the child because that is it. But then the car... Went downtown, apparently, and was coming up back East Street now to go east. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. The child started calling out, Daddy, Daddy, and then I realized now what is happening. And when I look into the car right at the stop sign, I see that the child was sitting in a former teacher lab that was teaching at the school that I had, was sending her, that is the kindergarten school. Yes. So by the time the driver to negotiate the stop sign, I step off from my friend and said to the driver, I said, driver, can I stop the car? But he apparently didn't hear because he was in the process of doing his driving. So, but he heard the sound. So when he looked out, no. And I said, driver, stop the car. The lady in the in the, in the the car touched him and said, no, driver, drive. So, you know, the driver has to drive now because he's a passenger. And mm. he doesn't know me. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So, I walked off the same time. And that was about after five, you know. I walked off down to anything you now with my tongue point bitter because I don't know what to do now. I'm, I'm, I'm at loggerhead because this is strange. Mm-hmm. So my journey led me to the police station because I'm I'm fragmented in my head now, not knowing what to do. I went to the police station and I relayed the situation to them. I said, okay, Mr. Williams, what you have said to us, please tomorrow morning go to the family court and relay this, uh, the, same, the same to them. Mm-hmm. I, did, I did that. So, so, so during that time, did you try calling the mother or the grandmother? I have no number for the grandmother. Okay. I contacted the mother. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't. I don't get. I have no number for her. Okay. Her, her number not not answering. Okay. Because okay. Then I realized now that she gone and leave the child now because her number now not answering. Yes. Anyway, I went to the family court the following morning. Relate the situation to them. Then I left and I and I and I and I went to my adult daughter's workplace, with, which is on Nepal Plaza. Mm-hmm. Told her, told her the situation, and she said, "Daddy, are you sure that they took a, a written statement?" I said, "I know that the lady took a statement, but I'm not certain it was documented." And she said, "Daddy, please go back tomorrow morning and make sure that they documented." It. And I did that. I went back the following day, make sure that they did they, they, they make a documentation of. The report that I gave. Yes. After leaving there, I went up by CBA. Mm-hmm. Right? And I and I do the same. And Papa and me, I tell us, say, yeah, about three weeks now, I've been going to family court. Because uh, I learned now that the child is at the school that I was sending her with the teacher. Yes. You understand me? Mm-hmm. So you learned within that time, so the child was at the school? Right. The one in the one in Westmoreland or the one in Mobile? The one in Westmoreland that I I was sending her. Okay. I went back to family court and I and I notified them what the situation. 
I told, I asked them to have somebody accompany me for the child because I, I realized that this thing can take take different turns. Yes. Right. Said so I said I want supervised um, assistance to go and collect my child. Yes. They said, Mister Willan, then 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 can then have no body to stand and all kind of all kind of read my rule. Yes. And I've been I've I've been going there back and forth asking them again, you know, brother. Mm-hmm. Have somebody accompany me to go for the child. At the family. Anyway, at the family court. At the family court. Okay. Nobody did. One Friday evening, I was coming from Burns Van in a taxi, and a little boy at the school came in the taxi. And by, by the time he came in, he saw me and he said, "Mr. Williams, Mr. Williams, Kara is at school." Because they all know me because I'm that far away. Everybody mm-hmm. I gonna know, me. right? Yes. So that 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 further confirmed now that she, the child is now permanently or whatever there. Yes. So I didn't say anything. Up. I started, I started having <laughs> serious thoughts now. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. The following Friday, I was coming from Burn Savannah and I realized the school gate was open and I stopped the taxi and I went for the child. Yes. While I was going for the child, the same little boy saw me. He was standing at the school door and he saw me. And just as I was coming to the gate, little boy turned his head into the, into the, into this classroom and shouted to someone that Kyra daddy is coming. And then he closed the door. But like it's like in the process of closing the door, you can you can surmise that somebody is asking how far he is. Mm-hmm. So the boy had to open back the door. So I realized that. So by the time he's supposed to open the door, I ran and reached the door and set my foot between the door. Yes. But I understand what is happening. You know? mm-hmm. When I entered the classroom, the teacher was in the classroom, the corner of the classroom, packing away her things, and my little daughter was standing there with her backpack on her, on her back. And the teacher gets hysterical right away and starts screaming, she's not finished with her work, she's not finished with her work. I don't answer her until now, Papa. Mm-hmm. All I did, hold my daughter hand and ask her, where is her lunch pack? And she said, Daddy, see there. And by the time I'm supposed to take it up, the teacher come and stand in front of me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right? And, yes. I, and I and I just reach around her, take up my, my daughter's lunch kit and walk out to school. Yes. When I was when I was walking out, she makes an uproar because the, the people in the upper the school, her mother, the lady upper the school, her mother lives with her too. Okay. Lady, so I know I know all of them like that because we had a relation, a good relationship. Right? I heard the, 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 the lady that upper the school mother come asking what is it? Yes. And the teacher was like. It's Kyra daddy come for her. Mm-hmm. And her mother said I must I must let him have her. So yes. that is when I realized now that something is amiss. Yes. I didn't I didn't do anything. I didn't say anything. I just listened to them. Yes. And let them do them. And I just grabbed my child, away from a taxi, grab a taxi, went down to this police station. Mm-hmm. Let them know that I went for my child. Yes. And it, what the person at the, at the at, in the station said, Mr. Williams, all you have to do. Go to the family court and let and do the same thing. And I went around there and I did the same thing. Let them know that I went and collected my child. Yes. That was a Friday evening and I did all of that. The following Monday, Saturday morning, I saw a car drove up in my yard. And it was the teach the, the, the lady that operated the school and her husband. Mm-hmm. Because she, apparently she was she was at the school the, the day before. So she heard what happened and she came. They came to my house. And they wanted to know what happened. And I said, I don't even want to talk to you, miss, because guess what? You knew no mother until a few months before graduation. You knew nothing about a mother. I registered the child at school. I put the child at school. I am the only person in contact with you and about whatever parents are meeting. <laughs> and you see, Kyra, you have Kyra, my daughter, under your whatever. And you don't see me, and you have my number. You are dis- I'm disposable to you at all, by all means. And you don't contact me and ask me, uncle or whatever you want to call me. Kyra is back at school, and I haven't seen her. What is happening? Mm-hmm. Right? Yes. And I, and I said, listen to me. I'm not sending back my daughter to that school. Please have the situation. Anyway, the shit, they talked to me, and you know, say I was a big person, person can't talk, and said. The mother come to them and say whatever, and 
they can only take what the mother say because what it so no you could have asked me what is happening all right do you know time when you pick up the, the, the child from, from from school you found out where the child was staying and she was staying with the teacher okay the teacher the teacher whose class she was in right okay okay right. i don't know where the teacher lives now i understand mm -hmm. right but i realized that it was with the teacher so the grandmother is living in westmoreland yes okay but she wasn't with the grandmother she was with the teacher she was with the grandmother she was with the teacher okay you understand me so coming on to the december holiday because i may i tell you how it is going so we have the child with me now so so when you took the child from that school you start sending the child to another school no so what what what, what month you took the child from that school it was in november okay and she didn't go back to okay go ahead mm -hmm. right she didn't go back to school i started homeschooling her because i'm still like that okay right i'm sad i started home but when i when i when i got the child it's friday evening by the monday morning i see some you know what you call water bumpers we have people we call them water bumps mm -hmm. water bump on the child's face and arm and after two days or so the water bump burst and then this child got Sure. Sure. Mm -hmm. Right. And I started watching them until I, I, I had I had antibiotic cream and I put it on it and I realized it wasn't remedying the situation. Mm -hmm. So I, I took her to the hospital clinic and the lady the, 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 the doctor advised that she got she got some virus, pick up some virus at school. I have all I had all all, all of those. Um when was it just when, when was it just the bombs on the Monday morning? Yeah, the, the, the Monday morning. Okay. So it ran into, into a week or so before I took her to the doctor. Then now I want, because I wanted to... No, but how, 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 how comes the doctor determine where she got it from? Where she got it from? Mm, how, the, how the doctor was able to yeah. determine that? I, I, was just, I was just telling her where she was. Okay. And, and all of that, and she determined that. Okay. Right. You understand? Yeah, right. yeah, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Right. So by then I wanted to enroll. I went to enroll her now at Sablamar Primary. Okay. This was now. Yeah. This was December or still November. December. Okay. Mm. Early, uh, I think yeah, this November, December, right around here. So, the, so, so, so the question is, the question is, um, not to in, in, interject a bit, but why when I took her from that school, they didn't think about enrolling her at South Primary right away instead of having her at home. Because of the bumps. Okay. Yeah. That's something because. Right? Mm hmm Right. So anyway, when I said, I said, no, I, have, I cannot keep her away from the formal schooling system. Yes. Like that. Yes. So I decided I'm going to en enroll her. So they did the test and all of that. And they said, yes, Mr. Williams, we accepted her. Because the principal and everybody knew me like that. Yes. But I, but I said, no, I cannot enroll her until I get the medical sorted out. Yes. Right. So when I took her to the clinic, no, they gave me another extended five days um, leave that I can, I can I have to have her on leave. Mm -hmm. Right? So that is when now the, 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 the holiday are coming down, or the December break is coming down. Yes. Right? And I started pondering, now, what am I supposed to do? You see, during the course of the week, what I'm telling you now, leading up to this, mm -hmm. I, came, I came to South to pick up some grocery for her. And I saw my police virgin. This part is important. I saw my police virgin, who is a friend of the mother also. And she stopped and, he stopped and said, Banja, come here. Because I'm calling Banja, come here. What happened to your ex-mother? Ex -mother? Yes. You understand? Mm -hmm. I said, nothing but then. He said, the mother, tell one of him squad that I went and kidnapped the little child at school. And the virgin turned to me and said to me, say, him tell the squad, he said, a lie, not no gossip, because I'm me take care of the child and the mother to lie. Yes. You understand me? Mm hmm And the virgin tell me, if you want me, say, warn me, I said, must be careful because situations can get ugly now. Mm -hmm. Because he, he wouldn't in the know on the other side as to what is going to happen. Yes, yes. So I didn't know anything. So the Sunday, the following Sunday, I came back to seven in the evening after I have a sister that works in Negril at the hotel and she came home like minutes to five. The following Sunday evening I realized that the little child rushing is running out. So I said, ask her to just 
oversee the child and let me go and pick up some groceries at the China. She said, okay, and I did that. I didn't have any, had any WhatsApp on my and the Wi-Fi on my phone. But by the time I came off the taxi at, at Shell gas station, uh, really, they had a free Wi-Fi and it activated my Wi-Fi. Yes. And the message started coming in. So I realized that there was a foreign number that a message came in and I realized it's from the mother. When I read the mother, when I read the message, Papa, the lady said that I, I went and took her daughter and I must give her daughter to her mother because she did a DNA and the child is not mine. Yes. She did a <laughs> DNA and the child is not yours. Did you ever do a did DNA? That? Did you ever do a DNA? No, I did. I haven't. Huh? No, hold on a minute. Uh, I, I haven't done a, a DNA. Uh, uh, okay, okay. So that is where now, Papa, I'm a freeze. You understand me? Yes. Me just took a seat and I reached back home in the night until about after after nine. Because my head gone now. So when we went when, when I went home, I didn't sleep at night. I just sit I just I just sit by the bed and watch the child. Mm. The look. You understand? You mm. know them red Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. So for the whole course of that week, we space out and watch the child out to see what is happening. I don't I don't know what to do. And I have a sister, another sister, she came up there and she tell me how the mother she, the, my sister literally cursed me out and tell me how I must care ex picnic go give her because she can't take her and tell her how I'm gonna take her picnic and my picnic and all kind of things anyway. But me I'm gonna deal with this thing intelligently now. Right? Mm-hmm. So I, said, I don't know what to do. See the police budget again and he warned me again and I said, No man, this thing is more than what me expect. Yes. You understand me? So that is how I stop at the I stop at the, at, the, at the school now this the, the following Saturday to inquire about the mother because I said I am not going to go to the child father who she said I must get the child or the or a mother or whoever I'm not going to go to them because something is brewing. So when she tell you that you are not the mother of you are not the father of the child, she told you who the father was. No, no. So it's not like she tell you say. She did a DNA and the child is not yours. The child is for X. She just tell us that the child is not yours. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. Right. And she left the DNA papers with her father. With her father? With her father. Okay. I contacted, tried contacted the father through his woman, who is the stepmother that where they live. Because him live with him, step, whatever, with mm-hmm. her stepmother. Mm-hmm. And I lay all of the information on that. I would love to see the copy of the DNA and all of that. The father contacted me again to to this medium and said that him don't have a DNA. Okay. The daughter don't left any DNA with him. I said okay. Me and the man had a we had a, a real big man um understanding up to that time I think. Mm-hmm. So it was mutual. So the so the Sunday the mother coming the, the Sunday after the after the after I stop at the school to ask the teacher what the, the lady that operate the school what is happening. Yes. Things start getting really heated on, on on my family part and everything. And I decided that I'm going to send the child to our grandfather for the holiday, for the Christmas holiday coming up because we always do that. So there was no form of skepticism, although what the mother said, there was nothing like that because man and man and I work with it too. Mm-hmm. Right? So I, I asked the, the teach the, the lady that operate the school to, to contact the, the grandmother and have her take the child up to the grandfather because that was the arranged that was the arranged situation prior. Arranged with who? Between the mother and, 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 and the grandmother. So you, you so you and the mother had an amicable discussions after that, after she told you that the child is not yours? No, we have no uh, had no contact with her after that. You don't we don't contact each other. So, who, no so she would have made the, the, the she would have made the arrangement with who? the child's grandmother. Right. Okay. Right. Mm-hmm. So the lady said, "Yes, Mister Williams, I can facilitate that." Mm-hmm. Do you understand? Me? Yes, yes. And I took the child here to have her go, and I did that. The following Monday, Monday, so. I tried to call the lady, I didn't get her. I got her the Tuesday, which was the school breaking up for the Christmas holiday. Yes. And she was, she was in the store in Saba and she said, Mr. Williams, oh, Kyra is here with us, but 
she's playing in the store with, with other children because they went to do some Christmas shopping for the school breaking up. And I said, okay, that is nice and all of that and all of that. And that she would be going up with the, with, the, with the grandmother the following day. And I said, okay, that's cool. And that is, that is all right. Mm-hmm. But from that up, I, I've been trying to contact them and nobody answering from that. That was December 2017? That was December 2017. Yes. And from that, nobody nobody contacted. All I'm trying to contact, no, there was no more, no more, no more, nothing more. Mm. Right? So I realized what is happening. So I went to the family court and requested a, D, a pattern, a DNA test. That's what I was going to say. You know, why, 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 when the mother tell you that, you never, you never go ahead and do it from that time? No, because guess what? Guess what? No, because a lot of people have been asking that. I realized that it is gonna have a. There are gonna be you no know, a custody issue. Mm-hmm. Right. Yes. And and a, 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 a DNA test that is not court sanctioned has no legal standing. Yes. Do you understand? Yes. That is why I go. To, I intend now to go through the court system. To obtain a DNA test. Okay. You understand? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And, and my doing that has led to me you now trying to contact you. Okay. So, um, the child is still in Jamaica. No, man. You know when when oh, what what happened? They, they took the child away from 2018. So all the time that I'm trying to get the DNA. Test done. The the court and along with other people has ulterior motive. Mm-hmm. That I it wasn't facil until today that DNA has not been facilitated. No, but <sighs> come on, ask the question. Please. No, I, no I'm, I'm just trying to think it through. How would the court facilitate the DNA if if it, if, it, if, if, the, if you don't have access to the child? The father, the grandfather, who has, who has, who who is in contact, I was in contact with the mother. Yes. And I asked the court to serve a substitute summons on him. To to do what? To come to court and 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 allay the information about the daughter. There, you, you, and, and you verified with somebody that there's something called a substitute summons. You ver- court, huh? I I I I didn't verify it, but apparently he came to court. So he came to court based on a summons that was served on him. Not on, not not on the basis of a summons. He started representing the daughter. So the daughter was served any at all. It didn't get to serve. So he came to court and what? What he told the court? That the the the. the the, the the girl whatever whatever she the baby mother yes yes she's she's what she's pregnant again and whatever can can travel okay 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 uh-huh. so so you ever found out when your daughter left Jamaica and under what circumstance uh, yeah man I went to I went to 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 Pika mm-hmm. and asked for a travel print I, I travel print out and all of that and I got it and all of that. So she left on the basis of a filing or she left on a visitor's visa or what? I don't know because what I got was just a travel. Oh, okay. Date and all of that. So you, 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 you kind of figure so maybe the mother sat out herself and, and take her up there then? Based it has on... to be. Okay. It has to be. Okay. Uh, okay, okay. And you haven't spoken to the child since 2018? Since 2017, since that that, uh, that, that, that date. December, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Out. So when in when in when in 2018 she would have left based on what Pika told you. July 2018. Okay, that so she should have been here one well, next like seven months before she leave. Right. So did you did you try to go to the house where she was was staying where, where her grand I, her grandfather live? Yes, ma'am. Ah, what you, you didn't and see? I, her? And I go to the and I go to the house with the police from from from. St. James? Yes, from, Bet- from Barry Town. Mm-hmm. Right? 
and they told me not to come out the vehicle. That is when I realized, and, and all of that time, that is when the discrepancies were going down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You feel like the police did not work with them? Yes, certainly. Okay, so when when you go there, you never you never see the child that time. What the, what the police no, tell you say when they come back? At noon time, huh? What the police tell you say when they come back in the vehicle? Since seeing that you never come out of the vehicle, what the police them tell you say? Say them not, them them are try can't them they not they not hear nobody over the yard. Hmm. Hmm. I never find out how we school she go during that time. We school? No, I'm not find out nothing. Can oh. we even go back at the school on numerous occasions until late after the child, after the child go away. Mm -hmm. have a I have a, one of my daughter has a never going to the school and then took a picture and sent it to me and said, Daddy, the child is still at the school. Which school? The, the one in Westmoreland? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sir. No, man. Papa, you want to know, you want to know the details, you want to go to the details, Carl. It's so much that it becoming fragmented some part. Mm -hmm. So when I went to the school, the child when I, when I got the message, I went to the school. The child had already left already. Just brought the child. It was the court who told me that the child is out of the out of the, the country. The judge told me. How did the judge find out? Somebody so, somebody would have told the court. Brilliant question. Mm. Brilliant, question. brilliant question. Mm. Very brilliant. On numerous occasions, they refused to serve the summons. And who? And who? At the home, so that the child, while the child was here. No, man, a, a summons cannot be served at a home. I, I was asking you, and who? Who should the summons be served on? Because the, the child's mother, the mother is not here. The, the, the mother. So apparently, it has to be that the mother was here, at come back at some point, and was here, and they were dating me. But well, you, but you are assuming that it's not something we are sure of, right? No, no, oh, okay. I cannot, I cannot okay, be okay, sure. okay, okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Right? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Because even when I went to, I went to, I went to, I went to Baritown Police Station on a numerous occasion. Yes. But, right? And they even refused to serve the summon, to go and have serve the summon. And at one point, I came back down by, by Freeport. Yes. And that, and and when I explain the situation to an ASP, yes. a female ASP. Yes. She was really mad upset and she got me into a vehicle. Other a, a, a couple to drive her and I up there. And she reformed them and said, Why on a refuse to to, to to serve the man someone and she complains to go and serve the, the man someone right now. Mm hmm And when she left because she got a call same time and she had to leave. Yes. And leave me there. And by the time she left, it was a, it was, wow, Papa, trust me. <laughs> I got a first hand view of what people are talking about. Yeah, yeah. Why, 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 in your view, you think the police them did that behave that way there? Because I heard that the, 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 the other father is a police, is a police. The, 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 the father who the, who the, Mother is claiming is the father of the child? Right. Oh, oh, oh. Who told you about that father? Eh? Who to, how, how, you get, how, you, how you become aware of that father? Word on the street. So the mother, didn't, the mother didn't say anything like that to you? No. Oh. Are you know the, you know the other, oh, you, you say you heard that he's a, he's a police or you know him? I don't know anything about him. Oh, me understand, me understand. I don't forget what I'm saying. Yeah, me understand, me understand. Yeah. But you see, uh, you, 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 I asked you about the DNA before, you know, and you were saying that um legal basis, but just for peace of mind, you know, <laughs> I would I, I, I would do it just yes, to ensure. A, a lot of people that say that, a lot of people that say that, but guess what happened? Because yes. Because I know that there was going to be this, and I know that on the grounds of that, it wouldn't hold up. Because no, I mean, I talk about it. That, that's what I'm saying, you know. I'm, I'm not talking about the legal part of it, you know. I'm talking mm -hmm. about the peace of mind, you know. I would have yeah, want to know yeah. whether my child and I mean, me might have still love her if, if I know my child, yes, but would I want to know at least for peace of mind. That's what I'm trying to say, you know. Yes. Because that's it, but, I know, like, so can't deal with the situation like that, you know. Yes, yes, yes. You understand me? All I wanted to know was to, was to know legally. Mm hmm. Because 
I am the one who who is the legal part of the child. I'm me sign a birth certificate. I me do everything. Yes, yes, I'm, yes. I'm, so if it's not my child, I want to know legally so I can disenfranchise myself from it and make the man have a child if it's, if it's so. Yes, 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 yes. Understand? Yeah, me understand. So the, the mother did have any 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 other children before before she? No. Okay. And you were in a row together for, for about how long before a child came into play? She got pregnant for me per se in that two, 2009 and lasted that five months and then. Okay, then 2011 again? Yeah. Okay. And you were together for, for about, about years before that? For about 2009, early 2009. Okay, okay. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Damn. Oh boy, oh boy. So, uh, what, what's the plan? What's, what's, what's the plan going for? What, uh -huh. what happened now? I went to every, I went to all the agents, every government agent. Me even have, you see one way in a controversy, you know, me have, me have a myriad of, 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 of things against them. Yes. That's the, that, that, um, that's about the CDA? Uh, uh, CDA, CP, FSA. Yes. I can, I can show you everything that I have. Mm -hmm. I was go, right? Mm-hmm. And I have, I had, when, when I was telling you about the DNA, you know, and the, the substitute mm -hmm. DNA of the, 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 the fat, you know. Summons. Summons, the, 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 whatever. Yes. I was in the court, the Savlamar court, for, that is where, it, that is where the irregularity started. Yes. Right? Mm-hmm. And when I went for the, when I went for, to have the DNA done, while the child was here at the time, you know, that, that is when they started buying time to do what they have to do. Oh. Right? Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. and, and, at, and, at, and at one point, I had the judge recluse from the case. The by, that was by request or the judge felt like recluse? I, I, uh, by request, I, I asked the court to, to have her recluse from the case because I, I detect irregularities. Mm. Yes, and they did. What kind of case was before the court? Just a paternity, just a paternity, a, a paternity request. Oh, and that was never that was never granted. Never. Mm. Right. So how 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 did that how did that end in the court? How how was it finalized in the court? One. The court was supposed, at one point, the court was supposed to furnish me with a date because I keep going to court mm -hmm. and the lady keeps telling, they all keep telling me that they, it, it, whatever happened, they cannot facilitate it right now and whatever happened. At one point, they're supposed to, 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 to furnish me with the court date when I'm supposed to come for, come and have my DNA taken. Mm -hmm. they, did, they didn't. And I was in Sheffield on the Friday that they called me and said, Mr. Williams, how are you not in court? I said, you are supposed to furnish me with a date. Mm -hmm. they, said, they said, okay. And here is a date. When I went, when I went that day, that they gave me, the judge said to me that, Mr. Williams, their lawyer is not, I am the only one there, and their lawyer is not in court. Yes. Right? Mm-hmm. Then the judge reached on her desk, took up a white envelope, waving it at me, and said, Mr. Williams, there's a DNA in here from another man who claims to be the father, so I don't think you wish to continue. Really? Yes, really? Yeah, why, yeah, why, yeah, listen to me? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And everybody in the court now was like appeased because... They had a goat against me now because I am this other man person now. They had a goat against me now. When they said that, everybody was like relieved that they get rid of me. So I looked at the judge and said, and I asked her, Madam, with all due respect, was that DNA sanctioned by the court? She said, no, sir. People get stunned. And I turned back to her and said to her, with all due respect, Madam, to my knowledge and understanding, and I emphasize on the word only, I said only a court order DNA is admissible in court. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Right? She looked at the, she turned to the clerk of court, or whoever it is that reads, it has to be the clerk of court, right? That would have, she turned to her and said, can you have it examined? 
when the lady look at it, the lady look at her and said, no, miss, it cannot be used. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and all the judge said to me was, Mr. Williams, if you have anything to do, go and do it and we'll call you. <laughs> <I'm sorry. sighs> May I laugh, you know, may I, may I laugh because me see, they, may, they give you a raw deal. <laughs> I don't know, I'm joking, brother. Yeah, 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 man. <laughs> because the judge was so convinced, uh, and then you uh, appoint out something if, if you never understand, you let us accept it and exactly. walk out. Yeah, yeah. So, even, <laughs> even, even lawyer from town come down about the case and they ask me, say, oh, because they thought the lawyer started, a lawyer from the government agency started, it was an uh, adoption case. So they sent her, send it down to represent me. But when she came, she realized it's an abduction case. Mm. So the lawyer turned to me and said, Mr. Williams, how come you are so knowledgeable about these things? And I said, I, I do my research with. Mm. People in the court walked out after the court and come and meet me outside, Papa, in a private cell and, and whisper and updated birthday. Do what you have to do here. Mm. Right? Policeman warned me to be careful. I have to literally back up at the case, Papa. I can't tell you detail, man. So, when was the last time you went to court? 2019. And the last time you went to court, what did the judge say to you? That's causing you not to go back to court. I, the last time I went to court, I went for a copy of the letter. I went for the copy of the letter that, that you took. Mm-hmm. Because I, re I, I'm going to, I said I was going to put it now into this lawyer hands and uh, whatever. Mm -hmm. I was going to, I was going to, right? Mm -hmm. And Papa, the thing that has been happening to me, it's, it's unbelievable. Mm. Yeah. I don't know, joking me at the budget. What your plan? What your plan for going forward? I mean. We are, we are talking now, yes, but what the plan? Or what, what you're talking to the lawyers and, and them tell you what is possible going forward because the child is what, in, in a Florida? Yes. And you, you try to make no link to find out where and what what what, 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 what you plan on doing? What, no, what's no. It? I was talking to a, 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 I was talking to a lawyer in Florida. Yes. She sent even letter to the mother. Yes. Of all the of all the the, 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 the things that possible things that can happen. Yes. And I do such things and I do things get away way again that even the lawyer said it is she you know in the jurisdiction and that and she even gave me another lawyer number but I was trying to contact them and I didn't get through. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Because I brought I, I I brought the matter to the to the United States Department of in the prison system mm -hmm. and they had interest at one point they had interest and they were even asking me the same question that you asked. Mm -hmm. How is it that that is the judge telling the child is out? How did the judge know that the child is out of the country? Yes. Right? Mm -hmm. So right now I am at I am at Lagerhead at where to go. That's why I am right here right now. Alright. Um finally, what 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 do you want? What do you want? Oh, uh, your child is away, whatever. Just tell me in a your words. What is it exactly that you want going forward? What, 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 what you want? What is your motivation? My main thing, Papa, was to, to, to ascertain if, if there is hmm? biological connection. Okay. So you want to satisfy yourself whether or not a few that are not biological. Yes. Simple as that. And right. if and if 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 you get that request, if that request request is is, is accepted, and um, your phone, your find out say. A your child, what's the next step, next step going forward? I need to be in touch with my daughter because I don't go my youth, them so brother. Okay. 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 It's as simple as that. Yeah, me, and my children have, me and my children have parental and, and child connection like, wow, exceptional out of this world. Yeah, me understand. Me understand. How much other children you have apart from she? Four. Okay. And you, you say you have a good relationship with, with, with them? Ask anybody in our South West Milan. Mm hmm Yeah, yeah. Because okay. a, a lot of men no business with them pitney, you know, and you 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 are fight you are, you are fight. You see even a mobia, you see mm -hmm. even a mobia. Yes. With a same little girl. Yes. I don't know, joking. Ask any mobia to some bushman original. Mm hmm From Berries to Gael to Brownie to mm -hmm. Jeremy and every one of them them love the pitney like a, a wall. Yes. Yeah. 
You can send me some, some more photographs with her. I have the child. Alright, I'm going to send you something. I'm not going to say anything. And I want you, because I was planning, you know why I took so long? Mm -hmm. I was planning to do my own show. Yes, yes, yes. But you can, you can, you can, you can still do it, man. You, you, you know, at least this is a start. You, you, you can still do things in your own words. Sometimes, you can, sometimes, hmm? sometimes we get taken aback by you know commentary, because sometimes emotions can get the better of you. And no, man, you can yeah. sit down, you can sit down and video yourself, man, and talk, and because yeah, you are going to edit your thing, you know, you are going to know what to put out and what to put out, and you can, yeah, you can, yeah, you can yeah. always do that, you know. And when, you know, it, when, uh, when, when you do that, I can, can always send people come 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 look at it because I, I father, it's a father's cry. All of, all of a man no busy with them with, with them with their children. And you 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 are fight for your for your own. At least to, to the first at first to find out if I yours or not. You know? That and is that is that is important. Papa, I mean no man, I mean no man I know argument, I know woman. Yes. Over them yes. All I want to do is it just to know. Yes. Yes, yes. You know and that is that, that is reasonable. Me no busy with layman term and people are talking about jacket and something. Me no put them in something and move me. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Me a conscious with that. So if it is that if it is that you 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 get fit for final say your child, would you have a, a an issue with the child living in the United States? No man. You, you just want you just want being in contact with your daughter from a year daughter. That's simple as that, brother. Okay. Okay, fair enough. Eh? Fair enough, in my view. It's as simple as that. And if I, you are the father to me, call and say, you're home with me, daughter. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? If I, you mm. are the father me, call and say, yo. You know, one thing, man, you know, them the things I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, you should know, brother. Yes. All yeah. I want to do is to know. Yes, yes, yes. Fair. Because I'm not living up, I don't live under belief. I take knowledge for that. Yes, 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 yes. You understand me? Because mm -hmm. even the court, you know, even the court, you know, I tell you this, you know, even the court, you know, as, as, as them, we, them and the judge in there argue, you know. Mm -hmm. That we make, we make the judge know, say, there is nothing he nor anyone can do. When it gets over point, I said, there is nothing you nor anyone can do to deny me the right what I'm having now. Mm -hmm. Right? Because I have a right to be protected from the law, by the law. Mm -hmm. And what I am doing is within my right to know Yes. If there, if there is biological connection with me and child, who I am yeah. the legal father. You know, see, that's why you get natural trouble, though. People don't like when people too knowledgeable, you know. They yeah. want, they, they want, if you can't tell you something, man, <laughs> you accept yeah. whatever I say. You understand? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Make, it, make it natural for that all the way. <laughs> yeah, so when the judge said to me, say, the, at the first hearing, when the lawyer coming up, yeah. So, William, there's something we can do because I'm going to say the child out of the country, you know, brother. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. George, you know. Mm -hmm. Mr. William, there's something we can do because the child is, is out of the country. The child is gone to a, to, to foreign. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, we know that, at that under that premise, we know that the child is not there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, when Mr. Larry says, you are wrong, madam. Mr. Mm -hmm. Under the UN Convention to which Jamaica is a the UN or whatever to which Jamaica is a signatory mm -hmm. the child ought to, brought, to be brought back to parent country and let due process be followed yes 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 me yeah. do me do everything I was trying to start a program but here mm -hmm. as I said mean, as I said mean, yes this you now is, a, is a motivation I'll start for me yes man start your program man start your program to, I am going to send you all the relevant yeah man, call your, call your program a father's cry or something to that effect. Yeah man. So, yeah man, maybe and just, just, just send me the link when you start it. Yeah man, that's enough. <laughs> Alright sir, yeah. respect. Yeah man, respect, respect. Yeah. Blessed love everybody.